Hello guys and uh, welcome. So everything is ready. As you can uh, probably see from the title, let's see if I uh, wrote it correctly because it's uh, 5 a.m. like it's super early actually. Um, yeah. I'm actually going to leave Idle Big Devil. And hey, how much? How you doing? And yes, you're first. Um, yes, I made a misspelling. Wow. Um, misspelled even the title forever. So. Yes, I'm actually going to uh, leave Idle Big Devil, and um, there are multiple reasons why, um, but there is like one thing that was already here since the beginning, where we like complained a lot of things. Sad song cute, yes. What time is it for you? Yeah, it's 5 p.m. So overall the game was fun, um, overall the game is still good, good free to play uh, friendly, but this world map got so many I would say um, bad emotions for a lot of players and so much misconcept and discord and everything. Um, of a lot of players that usually are like super friendly and help you out everywhere. Mm. The thing is, there was also a poll if people want the world map to be removed, and the majority said yes, but then all of a sudden the poll was like disappeared, and uh, we have some intel that X-Men himself told, I quote, <clears throat> Anyway, I will not remove world. There we go. So, with this said, um, we had some differences again in uh, the world map again with the top guilds uh, the first time it was with uh, firestones because there, there were like some I would say really toxic players um, back then he was like I think our world lucky something like this well this guy and somehow his mentality got over to a lot of other players that were like actually super cool. And um, especially one player that I really like respected a lot, kind of got in the midst of this and got this mentality taking away from others is like not only taking away from others and gaining yourself, but just taking away from others and I don't need it as well. And this goes like for a long time now, like we talked a lot about what happened. For instance, we got, um, again, by the way, completely zeroed of town, like everything that you saw here was like empty, everything, every single town and it actually happened already a few times and um, the first time yes it was a little bit frustrating but we like gathered up together quite fast, second time as well, um, this time kind of as well but the problem is that um, it still was the same like um, this time was different because people are just zero towns and just left them. So it's like not for you and not for anyone else. We're just letting zero. No one can have it. In types of this, um, let's say it this way, a lot of players already quit because of this. 
what's the point then? Exactly how much it. And the thing is, a good players took over this mentality. Like, um, to be honest, Chaos is a really good player. I like him. Uh, like I said, I respected him. Um, maybe it's just today, you know, everyone has a bad day. But he also like took this mentality over and yeah, like I said, it's probably was only today, so uh, don't blame him. But I also got a lot of also hate of this guild, like academy or something like this. Um, like of the top guilds. And the second guild where I didn't got any hate from other guilds like of course there were like a few players um, I didn't saw it yet Keok Sun I will see the um, after the stream um, I mean yes there's there are few MVP players few German hunters few Valorous few villains few tribes of hope by the way um, but overall the whole Toxicity getting like even more and more, especially like from Captain and Captain Academy. Um, especially towards me because like of um, the history with Firestones as well. But overall, like a lot of players, not only Tribes of Hope but also others, um, experience even this toxicity as well. And this came all from the mentality of like a few players and it somehow got, I don't know, overboard. Um, just an example, in German Hunters there were like three players that um, also fought about a few towns with Capney Academy and then all of them, like even they had like really small players, just got zeroed. And uh, I mean, for us it also happened, not the first time. And it just... It just benefits no one. It just makes everyone unhappy. Getting zeroed means someone else is going to attack. I mean, look at this. Here is an auto battle gain 15. But just, just, just like this. Uh, auto battle gain 15. No one gets it. It stays there. But then... People, of course, like fight, you know, okay, now it's 323, but it was 200 when I started the video. Um, so, of course, there are going to be even less towns where people are fighting against. So, this means, with well, this move, zeroing towns, people are hurting, like, everyone. And even though they wanted, like, Captain maybe wanted um, to help, their second guild, they actually hurt the second guild. And uh, that's a toxic, yes, it is. And the problem is that the same was, was with Firestones. The problem is that the players in this guild, they don't realize it. And this is something that I already explained the last time as well. Most of the people don't even realize it. They think they are in the right. For example, Nagaroth, or um, like, I don't really want like to call names, but there was like an, another one. They think they are actually in the right, and they put themselves as victims as well. And I don't like this. I like when everyone like is like you know playing together. Yes, of course, some PvP competi uh, competition is there, but. Just like it already happened where Firestones was bullying a lot of players. And something like this, it just it making people unhappy. So to all the Capney and Captain Academy out there, think maybe twice and try to understand the others before you know being like toxic and just zero towns so that no one gets a bonus i mean look at this this town here 15 percent no one touched it since i don't know for how long this doesn't help this helps no one absolutely no one and uh 
yeah. So that's enough from me. I mean, we also got, for instance, some information that uh, yeah, the highest guilds and the second highest guild got now everything covered. They got their bonuses. So I thought, okay, now we can like. You know, getting other towns just to try to get by, at least try to get um, the outer battle gains to 400 for other players, like for my guild members, so that they can rise. And I still got zeros. And again. And again. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Okay, guys. Um,. I hope uh, my guides still were hel uh, helpful to you. I would have loved to continue playing this game, but I just can't play this game if, uh, like, if the toxicity is still that up, that high up. Um, also, like in chats, um, I mean, of course, hate is gonna hate, you know, but it it was weird that the most haters came from Kapnia or Kapnia Academy. Yeah, and I mean, I especially, but I mean, of course, right, experiences that uh, a lot of times I logged in and I had zero towns, so for me it was nothing like super special to get zeros, mm, but the whole guild, it's kind of, it's, it's super unfair, especially it's for the smaller players, like, you have to think about the smaller players as well. Well... No Hamochi, I will not remove. Uh, I will not come back. This is it. This is farewell. Um, I still hope that, uh, that my guides uh, kind of be helpful and uh, yeah, I would have loved to continue making this gameplay. But even if the main game developer or i don't know game designer like uh, in this words x-man super cool guy normally like i say like he was super nice but uh, when the majority voted on a poll that they don't that they want this to be removed and when his words were anyway i will not remove world You get the idea. Anyway. <sighs> so. Protex out too. Well, Chaox, I mean, you probably didn't intend it to do this, but you did it. You have now less competition. And I'm pretty sure that the main thoughts of this came probably not by you. We all know who actually probably see the thoughts. So maybe consider, I don't know, putting a specific player out. Just saying. Anyway. I wish you all good luck, guys. Uh, have fun. Um, and I still go to stream, but other games. So I would say thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. And as always, stay fucking awesome. I will miss you. I hope I will see a lot of you guys on my other streams. Heart goes to you. I love you.